When I was 14 years old, I, um, unknowingly, because I didn't know what I was doing, I didn't, like, know what, like, what it was, I didn't know what it was, um, but I was playing around with witchcraft, and I somehow summoned a sex demon, and as crazy as that sounds, um, that is what happened, and they are, they are called sex demons, and they are called incubus or succubus. Succubus is a girl, and an incubus is a boy. So when I was 14 years old, this thing started coming to me, and I wasn't, and I was not entirely sure, like, what was happening was not entirely sure like what was happening because I could not fully comprehend um, at the time that the reason that that reason why I um, did that witchcraft led to that I did not it, it did not make a connection to that um, I will say at 14 years old I was we are not allowed to say that word on YouTube so that is what it is. I was told that something that you don't tell people, like you're just supposed to keep it a secret. At this point, I am, I am moved on from that, and like I am, I am healed definitely from that subject. But like, it's it's just questionable if that had like if this the first thing i mentioned um you know is it something that's mind or is it like the in an incubus but um it's it's been happening since i was 14 15 years old i would get attached by an incubus and right now I'm focusing on when it does happen to write it down, the dates. Is there something with the dates that it's connected to or is it just of random? And of now, it is just randomly um, in the month. So usually it would happen like once a month, once every six months, something like that. The reason why I'm like making a YouTube video about this subject is because um, there has actually been other people discussing the topic on the YouTube. So if really I just want answers like there are so many people like that I just tried I tried to talk to about the subject I joined groups. Um, in regards to that subject and trying, I'm trying to find a solution to get rid of the sex demon. Um, just like, I, I even though it, it's not sex, it's like, it's, yeah, it, at first it was fine because I didn't know what was happening. But now I'm, I just feel like, feel like I'm being just sexually harassed when it happens. So, yes, I am coming forward as, like, um, as is, like, a testimony, a testimony of, like, having these attacks is what it is. I know that there are, are going to be some people that are be like, you're crazy, whatever, but, like, I'm going to just leave my, like, email in the description of this video, and if somebody wants to talk about it to try to figure out how to get rid of it um i'm not gonna go into description of like what exactly happened to me because there are young viewers and there are perverts on here so that's that's just gonna be the end of the discussion right there but yeah and just see where we can go from there i like answers and i just like it to go away there has been times where i've tried to like wake up when it is happening and try somebody said mentioned to try to wake up and tell it to go away 
or like, you know, be gone, go away, shoo. But I, it's also sleep paralysis has something to do with uh, the whole thing because I ha also have sleep paralysis where if you don't know what that is, you can also Google it. But a vague description is you're pretty much pinned down, laying on the bed. I can't lay on my back when I sleep because it will happen and you will get stuck there and some people have like bugs crawling on them they it feels like there's bugs crawling on them or you know they're getting hurt they're getting stabbed or something something is being hap happening and in, in your you actually feel like you that happened in real life so that concludes today's video see you guys again soon bye